Hey y'all. Okay, so I had a strategy call with a gentleman in Pennsylvania this morning and he wanted to know, one of his questions was, what makes you different, Whitney? I mean, besides the fact that you answered, you were the one calling me, you clearly read my application, and I don't feel like just a number, what else makes you different? And I said, well, there's two things that make me different. The first thing that makes me different is when you usually have a mentor, you have a coach, you have somebody that's, you know, helping you teach something, a lot of people will use their mentees, they'll use their students, they'll use their whatever they call their people that they're teaching, they will use them to fill their pipeline. Okay? So for example, I'm teaching people how to buy houses. I'm teaching owner financing and lease options, right? Like that's what I specialize in. That's what you want to know when you come talk to me. You want to know how to get out of your job. You want to know how to set up a retirement. You want to know how to pay for your kid's college without having to pay for it. But I don't use your leads and turn them into my deals. I'm actually going to teach you how to be a one-man band, or I'm going to teach you how to be a one-woman show. I'm going to teach you everything that you need to know from not knowing anything to going to the closing table and getting that first check. I'm going to teach you marketing. I'm going to teach you negotiating. I'm going to teach you strategies. I'm going to teach you, or I can't teach you confidence, but by learning the marketing and the strategies and the you know, scripts that I'm going to give you, you gain confidence. No matter how long it's been your dream to get into real estate, something is stopping you right now. And the second thing that I give is I really care about my people. Okay? If you're having a bad day, if you're sick, if a seller hurts your feeling or your feelings, you know, tell me about that. Tell me all these things. I've been there. I'm not some tweed guy in a suit who only knows how to get people into their program. I'm actually a real estate investor. I've actually talked to sellers. I've actually had people cuss me out before. Okay? I've been through all these emotions that you're going through. And I'm here to help you get past them. There's good days, there's bad days. There's things in real estate that happen that have nothing to do with the actual deal. But if you go into a seller's house and you're nervous and scared and anxious, it's harder for them to have the confidence in you that you can get it done. So I'm going to work with you. I'm going to do role playing with you so that you can go into this being confident, knowing what you're going to say, knowing how you're going to say it, when you're going to say it, and why you're going to say it. Because if you say something in the wrong way or the wrong tone, you can kill the deal before you even get your foot in the door. And then when it comes down to the time where you're like, all right, Mr. Seller, I want you to sign this paper. It's a lot easier if you've already gone through everything with them. Well, all we're doing is finalizing it when we get to the paper. I've been dropping breadcrumbs this whole time. I've made you three or four or eight different offers the last 20 minutes that I've been here. And I've let us kind of work through this together. But when I say I care about you, if you're having a bad day, or you didn't get enough sleep, or you had a sniffle, and you didn't get your homework done, I also care enough about you that I'm gonna keep our appointment. I'm gonna keep your feet to the fire. I'm going to let you know that I'm disappointed in you. I will be your cheerleader if you need me to be your cheerleader, but I'm also going to be your sounding board and sometimes your conscience. You know you have a standing appointment with me. You know what you need to do that we're going to talk about, and if you don't get it done, you know that I'm going to be there saying what happened. Well, let's go back to square one. Let's start from here. And usually by the time our call is over, we've kind of sorted it out. 
We, we know what's going on. We know what actually stopped you. Was it really the deal? Probably not. It was probably something different. What stopped you from making that post? Did somebody say something to you and you didn't like it? Well, keep doing it because eight people were cheering you on. One bad person doesn't mean you should stop it. Okay? I'm also, I know I said I'd give you two things that I'm different, but if you need me, if you got a question, the people in my group know how to get a hold of me. If I'm going to be busy one day, I will say, hey, y'all, I'm off the radar today. But go ahead and talk amongst yourselves. I'll be back. I'll check on you in a little while. But for the most part, I'm really here for you. You're on your way to a seller's house? Let me know. You got appointments on Saturday? I'm waking up and I'm going to send you a message. Go get it done. Let's get to the closing table. Your goal is $10,000 a month? I know you can do it. I know that you've got all these opportunities that you can get it done. And I'm going to say, did you do this? Did you do that? Did you do this? Let's try this. Let's try that. Spin this. Go there. Try this. Okay. Come back. Let's try it again. I am going to push you when you need to be pushed. <laughs> I may drag you through it when I think you need to be drugged through it. But I'm here for you. When you schedule a call with me, you're going to get me. When you ask me a question, you're going to get me. And that's what makes me different. I've done these deals. I'm giving you all of my years of experience and knowledge. And I want you to take it and run with it. I want this time next year when you're sitting there and you got your $10,000 months, I want you to come back and say, all right, Wit, let's do it again. Let's do more. Let's go bigger. Let's go into something different. Tell me more. Let's do more. Let's keep this thing going. Because if you do have that bad day and you do, you know, flunk out, and lollygag around and not get your homework done one week, you know that I'm going to be there the next week, same time, same place, talking about real estate again. And that's what you get with me. All real estate, all the time. So if you want to book a call with me, if you want to get started, if you've seen my post about how you can do this with no money, no credit, no banks, and no license, let me know. I can put the link up, but know that when you schedule a call with me, you're talking to me. When you get into my program, you're actually working with me. So be ready for it, because I attract action takers. I attract people that don't make excuses. I attract people who have maybe dabbled in real estate or they, they tried it. It didn't really work. They got their feelings hurt and they left, but they really know deep down in their heart they want to get it done. And by golly, they're going to get it done this time. And I can show you the messages that I get from the people that started with me earlier in January. Oh my gosh, they called back. Oh my gosh, they're coming back to town. We're going to sign the deal. I'm going to buy this house. Oh my gosh, I've got so many leads. I had to stop and I'm going, no, don't stop. <laughs> when you start getting the leads, bring it on. Give me more. Give me more leads. That's when we got to set up a stronger system so that you can handle everything coming at you. So, if you want to book a call, if you want to get into the program, let's do it. Let's get started right now. There's two things that make me different. One is I'm not trying to use my people to fill my own pipeline. I actually want you to do the work and get paid for it. I want you to do the deal and go to closing for it. I want to see those big Cheshire grins at the closing table. Hashtag Whitney taught me. 
<laughs> and I want to see all these leads coming in, turning into houses, turning into portfolios. I want you to be successful. I really want you to succeed. And that's the second thing is that I really care that you're getting out there and not just doing the assignments, but getting it done as fast as possible. As many as you can do. And that's what makes me different. So y'all let me know. If you have any questions, let me know those. If you've got anything you want to run by me, let me know about that. If you want to book a call with me, you can do that too. I'll put the link up. It's start.whitneynicely.com. And I only take a couple different calls a day because the people I work with, I really want to work with. All right? So y'all let me know if you have any questions and I'll be back later.